This is a magnetic field pattern around a magnet. It points in the direction North Pole would experience a force if it's placed in the field. For example, if I put a North Pole here, it would, be, it would experience a force in that direction. If I put a North Pole here, it would be attracted towards the South Pole. The magnetic field strength is measured using the magnetic flux density, uh, which has a unit Tesla. So for example, over here, the magnetic flux density would be really strong. You can see the field lines are close together. While over here, for example, the magnetic flux density would be quite low, implying that the magnetic field is quite weak there. Here's the magnetic field around the Earth. It has the same pattern, but it's much weaker. Another thing that creates a magnetic field is a current carrying wire. So here the current is going upwards, and we're using the right-hand corkscrew rule to figure out the direction the magnetic field created around the wire. So the thumb is pointing upwards in the direction of the current, and the fingers show the curl around in an anticlockwise manner, which is the same direction that magnetic field is. Um, and you can see it's making concentric circles, and the magnetic field is getting weaker the further you are uh, away from the the wire. Uh, if you wrap the wire into a solenoid, you can make a really strong magnet. It, this is actually the same pattern as the magnet we saw earlier on, and the, this is what we call an electromagnet. And if you add an iron core, you can make it a very strong electromagnet. The solenoid rule is going to help us figure out the direction of the um, polarity of the of the solenoid. So, for example, if I look down this solenoid here, and I can see the current is going in a clockwise manner, it's actually a south pole. Okay, so that's the south pole. So here, yeah. and if, if I look down this direction, then I would see the current going around in an anti-clockwise manner. That was actually a north pole. So the uh, what you can think of as if you see it going anti-clockwise, it's a north pole, and if, it's, if you see it going clockwise, it's a south pole.